What comes to your mind when you hear or see the word palliative? Many people, appropriately, think of words such as compassion, dignity, or quality of life. However, for many people, what comes immediately to mind are the words dying, terminal, and end of life. Unfortunately, too few people think of palliative care alongside treatments to control the disease. I'm Dr. Gordon Giddings. I'm a palliative physician at the University of Ottawa and clinical content editor of Pallium Canada. The aim of this Pallium Doodle is to explain that palliative care is not something for just the last days or weeks of life, but should be initiated much earlier. To better understand this, let's look at the illness trajectory starting at the time of diagnosis of a life-threatening illness. In some cases, the disease, whether it be cancer or another non-cancer disease, can be cured with treatments. In other cases, however, the disease may be incurable. Let's draw a graph around this journey. On the x-axis is the length of that journey from diagnosis to death. On the y-axis is the goals of care, the treatment and care options and focus. Now, unfortunately, because people often think of palliative care only for the last days or weeks of life, they will only activate a palliative care approach in the last days or weeks of life. Let's look at the negative consequences of this. They include lack of symptom control with unnecessary suffering, inappropriate treatment choices, prolonged psychological distress because no one is addressing the fears and concerns of the patient, lack of discussions about prognosis, or lack of preparation regarding care choices and treatment goals. So what do we need to do? Well, we need to erase the old model of palliative care and use a different model, a different approach. What if we start palliating early in the illness? This does not mean that treatments to control or cure the disease and palliation and supportive care are mutually exclusive. The model of early palliative care is much more patient-centered and responsive to patient needs. Is there evidence to show that early palliative care is better than late palliative care? In a large U.S.-based study by Timmel and colleagues, the model of early palliative care was compared to the usual or common model of palliative care, only in the late phase of disease. What do you think the results were? Which group do you think did better? Which group had less depression and less anxiety? Which group had better quality of life and symptom control throughout their illness? Which group do you think lived longer? The early palliative care group experienced significantly less depression and anxiety, better quality of life, better symptom control, and astoundingly, they lived almost three months longer than those patients who received only late palliative care. So the key message is palliative care early is better than palliative care late.